Welcome back to our channel. If you're looking for fast internet speed and a secure connection, you're in the right place. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create a V2Ray VMS server account and set it up on the HTTP Injector app. It's super simple and will help you enjoy seamless and secure browsing. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share this video. Let's get started. First, open your web browser and type UDP Custom in the search bar then hit enter. In the search results, look for the official UDP custom website and click on it. This site is where we'll create our V2Ray Slow DNS server. Once you're on the UDP custom homepage, find the menu button, typically located in the top corner of the screen. Click on it to access a list of options. From the menu, select V2Ray Slow DNS server. This will redirect you to the server location selection page. Choose your preferred server location and you'll be redirected to the account creation page. Enter a username, complete the CAPTCHA, and click Create Now. Within seconds, your server details will be generated and displayed. Now that we've created the server, let's move on to setting it up. Make sure you have the latest version of the HTTP Custom VPN app installed. Open your Play Store, search for HTTP Custom, and click Install. Once installed, open the app and you'll land on the home page. On the home page, click the small arrow below the start button. A new window will open. Choose V2Ray as the tunnel type and click save. Next, click the settings icon at the top to expand the server settings menu. Select V2Ray and a new page will open. At the top of this page, click the small plus button. This will open a new window. Paste the V2Ray VMS server settings you generated earlier and save them. Once the data is added, return to the home screen and click Connect. You're now ready to enjoy fast and secure web browsing. And that's it. You've successfully created a V2Ray VMS server and set it up on HTTP Injector for secure and speedy internet browsing. If you found this tutorial helpful, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe to our channel, and share it with your friends. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.